see if that plays a role. Sherman's got it again, and he bolts up the middle a quick burst. Previous games, he was hot. Try to bring pressure on Fields, looking to throw on first down, checks it down to Sermon, who's got space, and a first down, and is still running, hurling men out of bounds inside the Clemson 35. Well, he sneaks out of the backfield, and he checks it down. Nobody picks Sermon up. They brought Skowski on a blitz. Nice job by the offensive line picking him up, and now you got Trey Sermon out in space, much like we talk about Travis Etienne. <laughs> Nice. He did that. He did that in a Big Ten championship game. He got, he's got elevation. He tried it the first time and got tackled. The second time he just took it up a notch and got right over the defender. You're right. Now he's got the ball again. Running left. Serving in the clear. Foot race. Touchdown. Ohio State. Buckeyes answer quickly. Matthew Jones is a left guard. 55. Clemson struggling to get lined up. Ohio State goes fast after the last play. Nobody there. The alley opens up on that stretch play. You can see Clemson not in position. Unlike them, not getting lined up. That cat and mouse game between Venables. He's healthy now with his legs. He only had 13 rushing yards in that game. There's Sermon powering to the left, showing no ill effects of that thumb, which is wrapped after he hurt it. Out of bounds against Northwestern last week, and this is Sermon barreling up the middle for another first down before Charleston stopped him. He's slanting his defensive line. Watch, watch Fields. He wants to keep it, then he gives it. He's like, there's no one there. Either you take it or I take it. Someone's going to get some positive yards because Clemson, they happen to slant and angle the wrong way, trying to guess which way Ohio State might be trying to go about the execution and what you're asking him to do. And bursting to the middle is Sermon, rumbling into the secondary, breaking tackles, stiff arm, and is finally corralled down near the 25. Watch Luke Farrell from the right, work back to the left, boom, that block right there allows him to get underneath in that inside zone play. This is the part of Trey Sermon that people underestimate, that stiff arm, how live that is. He does not go down easy, much linear than some of the backs that Ohio State has had in the past, 6'1", 215 pounds. And to see where he was early in the year. Sermon running into a crowded box. Now he bounces to the outside. A tough run. Good patience and vision. Loved him as a true freshman when he was at Oklahoma in that, in that offense. He played along with Baker Mayfield. And, and we've talked about how he was slow after the transfer. Slow to really come on. But as he gains confidence, he really can show you what he's about. He's got a, a little bit of everything as he's shown these last two or three weeks. Now makes another cutback. And Sermon moves the ball near the 40. So Ohio State trying to turn the tables here. They need nine on third down. Can Sermon get it? Spins, fights. Are you kidding me? They just run on third and nine and move the sticks in the country the right guard Wyatt Davis also sustaining keeping their their blocks sustaining their blocks to allow Trey Sermon to fight for those extra yards now fields from the pocket again took a look downfield just checks it down and it's Sermon in heavy traffic playing with tempo Tigers barely set this time field steps up dumps it down Sermon again has another first down inside the 40 how Nolan Turner can help this secondary out Ray Sermon had a big first half, and he bursts forward. Tigers don't bring pressure on third and one. They drop into coverage, and Fields, again, looking for someone, checks it down to Sermon. Can he get there? Yes, it's a first down. Out across the 20. Deserve it. The, the way they lost last year, there's no way he's coming out. Sermon breaks free. Gets the corner and scoots out of bounds. Theme after last year. Yeah. How, how about that little shake right there on Charleston? That play, again, designed to go to the left. And so let, let's see how he plays this up by 21. Well, handling the ball off to Trey Sermon has been a sound choice. They feed Sermon. His 27th carry tonight, and he just powers forward for nine more. What a story Trey Sermon has been. Monster game, breaking records in Indianapolis, breaking tackles and gaining yards. And flurries here. Charleston finally tackle him. He's heading towards 200 tonight.